Hey you guys, thanks for coming to check out today's video. So today's video is super exciting. I'm coming to show you guys some products that I absolutely adore. I have a huge haul for these products for you guys and as you can see, they are all right here. I have newly become a tote and carry ambassador and I am so thrilled and so excited because I actually am already very much so loyal to the brand. I made my first purchases of tote and carry products all on my own because I had seen them all over the internet and I wanted to grab some new bags anyway. And so when I saw this black owned brand that was really doing their thing on Instagram and people seemed to love the bags, I went ahead and grabbed all these bags using my own coins okay I hype this brand so much I talked about them like crazy that they sort of noticed me and was like okay sis we see you we see you loving the product how about you become an ambassador and continue to share everything you love about tote and carry so then they sent me these beautiful bags and then I went ahead and purchased this bag with my own coins as well. So I want to share with you guys um, this brand. <laughs> This brand is Tote and Carry. It's a black owned luxury, accessible luxury um, carry on tote bag brand. So all their bags are um, able to be carried on. They're all within the measurement and shape that you can airplane in the carry on compartment and they will definitely fit and they are within regulation. Even the book bag, the book bag is um, quite large but it does actually fit in the um, compartment where your feet are underneath um, when you actually sit down. So I do have the Apollo 2 set. This is the Apollo Extra Large Duffel. Um, love this bag and then this is the Apollo 2 backpack. Um, the backpack and the extra large bag are perfect for a weekend or a long weekend getaway. I don't prefer to check bags. I have a unhealthy phobia of checking bags. Um, I just feel like they could potentially get lost. People will go through my things, take my things, and I just don't like the concept of people going through my stuff or my things being out of my possession. I'm a little bit of a control freak, but we're not going to talk about that in this video. So I love carrying on, even when I'm going on long trips. Um, I, I pack a um, checked bag, but anything that I don't care about goes in the checked bag and the things that I super care about um, travel with me. So this extra large is great. I've done so many weekend trips or, you know, shorter trips and all I bring is this um, backpack and my extra large Apollo duffel and I absolutely love them. I also went ahead and got the hygiene packs match. Oh, this is the color tangerine. So this is the color tangerine. Um, I also got the hygiene pack in tangerine as well as the large fanny pack. This bag has become literally um, the bag that I use the most from all my tote and carry pieces. Well, we haven't gotten to the hot pink set yet, but this is the bag that I use the most. What I love about this bag is that it's adjustable. You can wear it around the waist, but my favorite way to wear it is around my body like this. I love wearing it this way because it's just carefree. It can fit over a coat or over a hoodie or you know, however you wanna wear it. But if, another thing that I love about this bag is that you can actually wear it in the front if you're concerned about anybody trying to go into your bag. You can wear it around the front and it looks just it looks just as chic and cute if you wear it around the front or if you wear it around the back. Um, wearing it around the back allows the toe and carry to be seen and I actually love the webbing on this. This um, is so cute, high quality, looks great and um, I just absolutely love this bag. Let me open it up so you can see all the things that you can fit in here. So again, I have a small thing of wipes, I have um, chapstick, 
I have mascara. Again, you can fit both of your phones in here. If you need to add a wallet in here, let me just grab a wallet. You can add your wallet in here, your face mask, and actually the way I do my face mask typically, when I carry my face mask in here, I love that it has this compartment at the top. I can just slide my face mask at the top so I can easily access that. And if you want more security for your license or your debit cards, you can put them in here and then they sit against your body. I also love the hygiene bag. I love that the hygiene bag fits perfectly in the book bag or in the duffel. Um, sometimes when I overfill my duffel, I'll just put the hygiene bag into my book bag. Hygiene bag fits so much, you guys. The hygiene bag is gonna fit your deodorant, your um, all your travel size items, because remember, this is carry-on. So don't make the mistake of putting things in this hygiene bag that are not um, the size for the airport, because remember, you're gonna take this on your carry-on. I made that mistake one time and had to throw away my entire Fenty cleanser bottle, because I put my Fenty cleanser in here and I was so blown, I literally had to throw it away. But I guarantee you, that TSA, that TSA lady did not throw away my Fenty cleanser. I know, it's in her house. It's in her shower right now and she's using it. And I'm angry about it. I'm not over it. All right, sorry, I had to take a call. So your hygiene bag is going to fit your travel size item. Shaving cream, well these are the things that I bring. Your deodorant your body wash, and I always have two options of body wash. You're going to have your micellar water. I always use this to cleanse my skin from my makeup. Um, you're gonna have enough room for your body spray, whatever type of perfume you want to bring with you. I always bring two different types of deodorant. I bring a regular deodorant and a spray deodorant. This is fire if you don't have it. Your lotion, your facial cleanser, um, another skincare item, always bring ibuprofen or Advil or Motrin with you on your trips. You never know when you get a headache and it is the worst having a headache in the airport or while you're traveling and not having anything to take. Of course, you're going to have your toothbrush and your toothpaste. I wear contacts, so you wanna have a mini contact solution. I also always take airborne with me when I'm traveling. Um, you can literally just pop this into a glass of water and it helps keep your vitamins up because we don't wanna have those problems and your razor. So all that fits in this hygiene bag. Like, y'all, this is a lot of products. Like, this is a lot of stuff that you can fit in this hygiene bag. So you want to make sure you grab this as well. Like this is hugely important. Your backpack, um, I love the fact that your backpack has this space here. This is where I always put my passport as well as my um, debit cards and my license. I don't typically travel with this through the airport. I usually pack this because this for me is an accessory or a purse and I don't want this to count as my personal item when I'm traveling through the airport. So my personal item when I'm traveling through the airport is my backpack. So I use the backpack for all my boarding passes, my license, my passport, all that I put in here. And then I usually put my um, laptop. I'll put my laptop in here. I'll put any other paperwork or documentation I need in here. Typically I will put, um, de uh, not deodorant, typically I'll put gum because I always travel with gum when I'm in the airport because sometimes you get a little self-conscious like if you fall asleep on the plane and then you wake up and you know you have that like taste in your mouth. So I always have gum in here. And then I always travel with a sweatshirt or a hoodie. You wanna travel with layers because it's always either too cold or too hot on the plane and you're like literally uncomfortable the whole flight. So I always put my sweater or my hoodie in my backpack because remember, the backpack is gonna go under where your feet are. This is gonna be stowed away in the top compartment. So you're not gonna be able to get your hoodie 
out of this. So I always put my hoodie or a shawl or a blanket or even like slipper socks. Sometimes my feet will get cold. I'll put slipper socks in here as well um, because this will be right there with you um, on the plane. Of course, I always have hand sanitizer wipes in here and um, old boarding passes and stuff like that. So definitely love the backpack. Love it, love it, love it. Let me show you what it looks like on. Very comfy to carry. I know it looks like it's big, but it's really not. Um, it's very comfortable. It's very soft. Um, it, it conforms to the body, but it also keeps its shape. I've had this bag for almost a year now, um, and it still keeps a great shape, but it's just very comfortable on. Um, it feels good, it feels cozy, and I just love the look of it. I cannot tell you how often I get stopped in the airport when I'm carrying these bags. I have literally influenced so many people to check out this brand and to try out these bags because I'm literally just in love with them and just walking they're so eye-catching um people just stop me all the time when I'm walking through the airport with these bags they're just eye-catching and um when I start talking about it people are like damn she really likes that like I'm not getting paid to say that I like it. <laughs> they, yes, have asked me to become an ambassador, but I buy the stuff even now that I am an ambassador because I just love it. So let me show you guys how much stuff fits in my Apollo Extra Large Duffel. Now, I haven't packed this as though I'm going on a real trip, so I kind of just took like piles of laundry that were already folded and just like sat them into the bag, but I want to show you how much theoretical things can fit in this bag. And here's the third pile of stuff. Like... Look at all this stuff. You're literally all packed and you still have all your room for your purses, your shoes, your sneakers, your boots, accessories you might need, your makeup. You can literally put all these things into the bag and still have space. So, love, love, love my tangerine set. Let me move all my junk out of the way so I can show you my other set. So, Tote & Carry does have a new collection of women's handbags. So excited when I saw those on the site. I could not wait to get my hands on them, but it was quite a long wait, but they have arrived. And this is the Apollo 2 tote bag. So, when I was asked to be an ambassador I was so excited I was like yes I need the Apollo 2 tote bag this bag is everything it's pretty much the same size as the backpack but you carry it like it's a purse and I love having the option of carrying this bag like a purse so the tote bag is absolutely huge, um, but in a good way because you can really fit all the things you need in here. This is the cutest detail right here. Absolutely love the little keychain bag. Love the gold detailing as well as the cowbell here and the branding is always spot on. Love all the gold hardware and the details and love the fact that you can wear this as a crossbody as well. This color is absolutely stunning. You will get stopped. Now let me tell you something. This brand is not for the faint of heart. If you're getting involved with the colored 
items from Toad and Carrie, you will be the center of attention with these bags. Um, but I love it because I'm a total extrovert. Um, they do have more subdued colors like tan, camel, um, brown, and black. But, I mean, when there's hot pink, why choose black? <laughs> and the last piece that I got that I had to low-key persuade them to give me because what's the what's the deal with just having one when you can have two so I had to make it a set Apollo um, duffel and this is the regular size so I wanted to try the regular size because I feel like the regular size would be great for shorter trips like just the weekend this bag is great for weekend trips as well as trips that are even longer than that so here's the size difference between the duffel Apollo um, 2 duffel regular size and the Apollo 2 extra large so here's the size difference let's see if we can figure out if this bag will hold as much as this one. So I'm going to take, look at the structure of the bags though. Like the quality is just there and it has a crossbody. I didn't show you guys that this one has a crossbody as well. That comes in handy at the airport too because these bags can get a little heavy um, and they are totes, but you can definitely put them around your body and the crossbody definitely comes in handy. And this soft um, cushion area is really important too. It definitely takes that pressure off of your shoulder. All right, so let's see what we can fit in here. We still have space. And let's see if there's still space. Let's throw a couple things in our hygiene bag. So the hygiene bag is in there. We still have space. Let's see. Just for kicks and giggles, let's see if the messenger bag will fit as well. and just like that, okay? So we're talking about form and fashion in one. We're talking about luxury at an accessible, affordable price. We're talking about black owned, fly ass accessories that are taking over Instagram. Like what's not to love? What's not to love? Tote and Carrie is that girl, and I'm gonna need you guys to stop playing and go check it out. All right, you guys, thanks for coming to check out this video. I love sharing with you guys products that I'm excited about, products that I think you should definitely be checking out and adding to your collection. Holiday season is coming. What better option to give someone the gift of beautiful, affordable luxury travel on accessories? Definitely make sure you guys check out Tote & Carry. I will have a coupon code in the information box down below for you guys. Shout out to Tote & Carry for making me one of their ambassadors. I am so thrilled and so excited to be sharing this brand with you guys. Make sure you guys share this video. Give it a huge thumbs up. Share it with a friend. Share it with a travel on, black owned business lover. Share this video with your mama. Peace.